to do here at Gulfport Park. Hike, hike, swimming, canoe, kayaking, eat, sleep, camp, camp yeah. and enjoy. That's awesome. There's back there's also backcountry camping. So there's backcountry camping, there's yurts, there's lodges, um, there's a ton of trails, a ton of lookouts. There's like a beaver dam trail, the lookout trail. There's lots of trails everywhere. Lots of different beaches, secluded um, little lakes where you could just swim and nobody around. Um, a lot of people here too um, do try to look for animals. So some people do like bird watching. They go early in the morning or in different parts. You can get a guide to assist you with looking for certain animals like the bull moose. So here at the park, they offer services like bike rentals. You can canoe rental, kayak rental, paddle board. When we talk, making echoes as we walk. There's no one left but you and me. And what did we bring with us today? We brought snacks, snacks towels, Skittles, Skittles. <laughs> emergency kit, Mama, water bottles. Not yet. Hungry? Like, and candy won't feed your well, we'll see you when we are in the water. Okay, flipped it. It's going in, it's going in.
No, she gets the long one. Bye, my dearest daughter. Yeah. It's easy. Put in front of you if you want to turn. In front, yeah. Okay. Whoa, 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 whoa. Side of his done. All the good times just begun.
what's up? If canoeing is like this, what about boating? Real boat. Look at this. We just stopped over here and we're chilling. Imagine what it'd be like to have a, a boat, a motorboat. Hmm? Mm -hmm. we Coming just soon. Up. We can just don't let them know. Don't tell them. Oh, yeah. Pretend you never heard that. Come on, home. We keep going in circles, but we're getting to the place where we're going. Hey, good morning, good afternoon. It's the Shivindas, and we're out here in the middle of Lake Opiongo. Where is that, you ask us? Of course, it's here in our backyard in Ontario in an Algonquin a Provincial Park. It's so huge that every year we come, well, all the times we've come here to camp, we don't go to the same spot twice. So this place is amazing. Look at that, hours and hours. Apparently Lake Opiongo is the largest lake here in Algonquin. You can do easily 25 kilometers straight and you still wouldn't hit the end of the lake. That's what the guy said, I don't know. And uh, yeah, we're just looking for a spot to kind of rest. We've been paddling our boats for our canoe for about a good two and a half hours now. What have we done? We've seen trees, trees on this side, trees Wait, on that hours? side, and more lake. We did, however, collect some mussels. So those are good. We're gonna cook them for dinner. Yay, thank you, Bao Bao, for hours? my mussels. Uh, not these mussels, the yummy mussels, uh, edible ones. We're finally getting the rhythm of canoeing because when mom and dad each have a paddle, we just go in circles. <laughs> so I don't know. Have you guys tried canoeing with your family? Um, I think this is the first time we've ever gone this long on a canoe. Have we ever gone canoeing? No, we have not. Wait, and if you. And if you can see Myra, that way. Myra's right over, right there. That's Myra. She has her paddleboard for the day. So if you guys are thinking to rent a paddleboard, I will let you guys know. So for the day, it's 24 hours, but it has to be the same calendar day. And uh, a two or three person kayak is about 40 bucks get a paddle but you got to rent these guys if you don't have a life jacket you must have one and that we also rented a paddle board which is about the same price you should come and if you want to you know canoe for the whole day I suggest you come early and um, yeah just canoe for the whole day we turn it before 8 p.m. I, I believe we at first initially thought that you you know if you rent at 12 at noon You'll get it and return it the next day at 12 at noon, 24 hours. But no, it's not. It's actually the calendar day. So come early and return it late and just enjoy a day out here in the open, in the wild, exploring Ontario, exploring Canada. Woohoo! Getting sunburned since we can't be out in the Caribbean or in the Philippines tanning. We'll just tan out here. Thank you, proudly sponsored by those paddling. <laughs> Are you getting tired? What's happening? I just want to move but I can't. Uh... We're going to the beach soon. We're finding a... <laughs> it took us three hours to get back. Not three hours, maybe an hour or two. It took us about two hours to paddle out here. What? Yeah, so maybe another hour and so paddling back lake opiongo there is no one in sight this is the best way to practice social distancing yeah <laughs> we're literally around nobody literally there's nobody around us yay okay guys I think I should support um, our dear, my dear husband over there. Oh, come on, honey, you can do it. Go, row, 
bro. Uh, really? It's okay. Just enjoy the sun. That's okay. No biggie. Nowhere. We're going to the beach now. Okay, that's a wrap. Just arrived here. I mean, uh, we got here in this island. There's a lot of clams. Wow. There's so many tiny islands, so we just decided to stop here and uh, see somebody was barbecuing here. They had the charcoal and the wood. And there's a lot of uh, tea clamps over there. You know what, let me go up this way and check. I don't know, Eric. 
not to go all the way straight that way um, after two and hour two hours two and a half hours of paddling we decided to turn back because the kids are getting tired it is a little bit hot and we didn't pack enough food we did bring a lot of water drinks yeah that's right good that math skills so that's why we decided to paddle back because we don't want to go out five hours that way and then thinking we have been, we have to paddle back another five hours. So, and that's the thing that uh, my husband and I, we, we like to do is when we're out doing things, we don't want to wait till we're so tired because just packing up and getting ready to head back is also a lot of work. So that's why we're turning back. We're going to look for a nice resting spot, resting area. Have a nice picnic and the kids and let the kids just swim all day. That's it. What more could we ask for? Should I help you paddle now? No, Jean, you gotta get back to <laughs> Every time, every time I paddle with them, we just keep going in circles. So yeah, he decided to paddle on his own. Myra, where are you? Can you see Myra from here? She's right, she's right there, right there, right there, right there. There she is. All right, guys. So, if you ever decide to go canoeing with your kids, we don't highly suggest it. it. <laughs> so, don't do it. Yum, 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 yum. Nothing better than chips out on the sea. Oh my God. I know, we're so far. It's okay, we can do it. Slowly, slowly, but surely, we'll get there. We always find a way. That's the Shivinda way. We always find a way. Wow! What time is it? It's five o'clock. We've just returned our canoes. Like five o'clock. So we literally canoed for like five, six hours. Wow! And it's still super hot. How's everybody feeling? Going to the beach, we'll see. Just give us 20 minutes, let's see. See how we're feeling, okay? I actually want to go to the beach. But I think we've been out in the sun for too long. We're feeling sunburnt and uh, hot. So let's say bye-bye. Opiongo Lake, bye Opiongo Lake. See you again next time. We haven't gone canoeing, but it was on our list, so today, that's what we accomplished. Until next time. Ciao.